Okay, with the sleep position, I like to go through that, and there's three different positions, on the front, on the back, and on the side. Ideally, you wanna be sleeping either on the back or on the side, but we can even go through a modified position for those of you who can't change that front sleeping position. So if we look here, basically if we're sleeping on the back, it's pretty self-explanatory, <laughs> having the head up in that sort of comfortable position. You can actually even have a thinner pillow as well, if someone prefers, if they maintain that sleeping on, the, on their back. Um, if we start moving on to the side, if we go this way, Side is also a great position for spinal stability as well. Just a couple of things to keep in mind. Often when people sleep on their side, that top leg rolls over like this. So when that rolls over and it's left unsupported, it puts that torsion or that twist with the lower back, but also through the neck, it counter rotates slightly as well. So the way of correcting that is to just basically put that leg in a more neutral position and that will automatically readjust what's happening in the neck as well. If it's a bit too uncomfortable having the knees um, closing upon each other, what we can also do is put a little pillow in between and see if that makes things more comfortable. You don't have to, but that can assist. And also with the shoulder positioning, not being just straight on the shoulder, but also not being, having that shoulder overhead and that also can compress the shoulder and the AC joint and cause some problems. So just to keep the shoulder just slightly out in that position, or it can even be under the pillow, that's fine and that's great natural position for spinal stability. If you get you jumping onto your tummy for me, thanks. If, if you are to sleep on your tummy, you can actually, it's not ideal, it does, does can sort of accentuate pressure in the lower back and through the neck, but if someone, uh, that's the only position they can feel comfortable. One a couple of tips you can do is first and foremost, lose the pillow. That can start to assist. And whatever side your uh, head is facing, what you can do is put a little pillow underneath that same hip and just lifting it slightly up as well. Being in that position can start to reduce a bit of that um, stress on the spine as well, if you, that's the only position that you can feel comfortable.